Hello, my name is Ashley. Today I'm going to show you how to paint flower mums, which is this is the flower that we have here. And uh, this is, of course, it's artificial flower. I didn't have it in my garden, but I'm going to show you how to paint mums. It's a very beautiful flower, yellow color. It comes with white, yellow, and other different colors too, I guess. This is so beautiful. So now we're going to start. All we need for this mums, of course, yellow, white, a little bit maybe uh, bird sienna. And then if you want to do the leaves and whatever, we need green and we need brown. So, and always remember, again, you have to have your color chart so you can see what color you have to mix. And always have a odorless turpentine. And we need a little bit linseed oil mixed with a little turpentine again, in case if you want to make it a little bit, uh, you know, thinner, the paint. So this is the background that we have here that I already done. You can check my other videos, you can see it. So we're gonna start to do the flower now. Uh, all right, and always make sure that you have your uh, paper towels in your hands. So now we're gonna do first, we have to kind of make the shape of the flower anytime you do it on a canvas flower just don't make it exactly in the middle but here the, just i'm showing you so the flower for you so i just uh, i'm just because i'm showing you i'm just doing it and when you start now the background first do a little bit darker yellow and uh, bird sienna mixed together because when we put the flower uh, we have to make background always like i said it always goes darker and then the front goes lighter like three three steps we do three or four steps it depends how much light do you want for the shades and everything i should really get the bigger brushes but this is a filbert brush and we have to put really good paint again just like the uh, on my other video that you see the hydrangea the way I painted just simple round circle it doesn't have to be of course circle you can make you know extra because you see the the mum flower it has a lot of different petals like it's outside messy so none of the flower is perfect so you have to just put here and there, tap it, and put as much paint you can. That's the whole thing that like, you know, the, the mums are always like standing up the, the flower. It's like lump. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna add some more paint over here. I didn't put enough. So always have your beautiful uh, easel. You can do it outside. The turpentine smells a lot, but just try to have an odorless turpentine. So this way you can work inside, but it's always nice to do out. So now we have to mix red and yellow a little bit together to make it kind of orange. And here and there rub it different colors. Because when you do the mums, you don't see one color. All right. There you go. Now we have to do the petals. We need really good lump colors to make. All right. Now while you are painting, make sure you have kind of cut it in half. Anytime that it doesn't, um, excuse me, I need, what we need is for our painting, when you see you have a paint and it doesn't stick, we have a white, clear color, clear white. So what do you do? This is the very, very good thing it is to be able to attach the color to the other color. Like if when you cannot when you see the paint it's not holding, you mix it together and when you do it, it does. It, um, 
you can paint easy so you make it first like in the middle line so you will start to do the pedals the pedal goes for the bumps when you do it you just start it to do like this make sure that you put good lump paint on it and the other side you do this It's very simple and easy painting it is. And it comes very beautiful. So the top ones of course because you can't go round and round like this. You just tap 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 and then you push it back here there. You see how it goes. Just always put white clear on it so it does all the color for you. And around here, just turn it a little bit outside, inside. The colors, like I said, the mums can be up and down the ends. That's how, and then sometimes you can, let's say the flower is like this way, you can just like the leaves can go. When you turn it, you can always like show the ends, um, like the flower ends are turned. Let me see how. For example, the leaves are like this. If you want to make it a little bit curled up, you can go just smoother like this and make the leaf shows it's curved. This is very simple flower. This is the mums. Now we have to add a little bit white on it, which it is again, you mix it with the clear color. The white, it said the white clear is just for holding the other paint. It, but sometimes it can change very little the color. Otherwise it's not for um, coloring. That's only for holding your color. Like if you want to do highlight now, for example, it doesn't hold. You can just use a little bit here and there or wherever like the sun is hitting the color. You just have to put the white. This is the, the top one. 